why do I have joint pain? This is another great question that a lot of people suffer with. You know, it can be from a former injury. It could be because we think we're getting older and the cartridge is re uh, reducing in our joints. There's a lot of different reasons we can experience joint pain. But one of the ones that doesn't get talked about a lot is emotions. Your emotions can be stuck in your joints and that can cause a lot of pain and discomfort understanding what the root cause of our joint pain is and providing support to those things can really mean the difference between having a good range of motion and, and comfort or discomfort. So getting down to some of this, you know, let's say you did have an old sports injury to your knee or something. Well, even if that happened, your body is really good at healing itself. So over time, if that continues, you know, I don't know, say 20 years later, you've got joint pain and you think, oh, it's because I was this great athlete when I was younger. And now I don't do that anymore because my knees hurt, right? Well, that can actually be a sign of a lot of different things. It can be deterioration in the joint. It can also be emotions. It can be uh, inflammatory response. It can be changes in your bone structure. It can be a lot of things that are contributing to it but there's equally enough things that we can do to support it and actually heal it. So things like diet, supplementation, a gentle movement, um, you know, looking at different kind of bone and, and joint health supplements can also be good for you. But just really understanding where it come from is really step one in to, to controlling our response to joint pain and where that can actually lead us in our golden years in terms of health and well-being as well as our flexibility and movement in our elderly years. So if you're looking for support with that, you can reach out to me at dragonspitapothecary.com.